Hello everyone, and welcome to our, our updates on May 17th, 2024. So yesterday we saw some big storms over Ireland, especially in the Midlands and South. Uh, some big downpours there with lightning. Now last night we saw this longer area um, of heavy rain coming in. Before this morning we do see um, a lot of cloud cover away from Ulster with some patchy drizzle. Um, that will gradually fade away into the afternoon. Though so there's a risk of a few showers in the south with the possibility of some heavy bursts for a time. And also into the evening, it should it should get a bit sunnier, especially in the north. Um, so there will be some clouds all around, especially in the south. Now into Saturday, we see a few, we see a few showers overnight into the morning. Before, before Saturday, it starts cloudy, but it gets brighter through the day and there's just a chance, the slight chance of the odd shower in the southeast of the country. Into Sunday we see um, some showers forming in the south, some heavy and thundery and these will push westwards, th westwards through the day and elsewhere it's dry and fair. Into Monday we see some big downpours forming, um, heaviest in, in the Midlands west and north with risk of hail and thunder there. And Tuesday, you see some big storms forming over the country. I think those those would be like today's storms. Um, lot, lots of lightning, hail, and so on. Moving on to our temperature forecast, then we can see that today was quite a warm day. With well, should I say yesterday was yesterday was a warm day with highs of around sixteen to to twenty degrees. Tomorrow we will see highest temperatures ranging ranging from again around fifteen to twenty one Celsius warmest in the north with the best of sunshine. Into Saturday we see highest temperatures, um, the same values really, but highest this time in the southeast um, because northern areas will be exposed to a northerly wind. Uh, a, bit, a bit cool to start on Sunday before highs on Sunday reach around um, 18 to 22 degrees warmest in lands into Monday we see similar highs again warmest inland and in the east and Tuesday uh, temperatures do drop by uh, by three degrees and temperatures may still, reach, may still reach 20 though in the east. Moving on to our NAO index observed and forecasted so we're currently um, around neutral with the index but it will go it will go more negative into the rest of May which does indicate uh, lower pressure um, to dominate, but that won't be the rule, um, really. There will be there will be quite a few um, phases of dry and warm weather, and also mainly with these lows, it's showers, not constant rain. So looking at the GFS twelves then, so we've got this easterly wind tomorrow, bringing quite a lot of cloud, but it should brighten up towards the evening, especially in the north. And moving on into the weekend, we see. This um, slight ridge, a slight ridge of the country that will bring a drier spell, but there'll also be a few showers around, especially on Sunday in the south. Now, now next week, pressure does again weaken, so we see more showers and storms forming Monday and Tuesday before into Wednesday. This deep low forms over the country, and that brings wet and breezy weather. Beyond that, we see easterly winds coming in with a high to our northeast. And we go into the end of May looking warm and possibly thundery with these troughs of, troughs of low pressure coming up from the south, um, introducing the instability and the easterly winds with the warm air. Warm air and, and, and instability cause these um, storms. Now we get to 1st of June on this run and by then it's looking uh, cool but mainly dry. The ECM 12 says it's like this, so again tomorrow is quite cloudy. And then into the weekend we see higher pressure forming, so that means that we will see some decent weather. And by Monday and Tuesday we have showers again, some with storms. And next week, actually by the end of the week, we do see the Azores high getting influential. So GFS is different to the ECM. And we go very warm there and quite dry towards the end of the week. And it stays warm and dry into the end of May, it seems, with this big, big extension from the Azores Eye all the way towards Scandinavia. 
here is a GEM. So GEM is again having this low pushing to ourself and filling tomorrow. Um, that will leave quite a cloudy day though, but it should improve towards the evening, especially for the north. And it's the weekend, pressure is quite slack, but it is high. So you've got a decent week we got a decent weekend coming up with just a chance of the odd shower. And next week, as I said, pressure will lower, allowing convection, instability, thunderstorms early on. Before midweek, we see quite a cool day on Wednesday, I think, there, with areas of rain. And actually, like, like, like the ECM, the Azores High does extend up th through the country, and we end up warm and dry by the end of the week. Um, well, don't you know it? It's the exam weather coming back. The exam weather. Don't you love the weather around the exams? Um, this year I'm free of exams, so I, I mean, I'm fine. Um, anyway, so here's the UK Met Run. UK Met Run is like this. So once again, the low pressure is filling and and going southwards, and the weekend is decent enough, really. But on Sunday, there's a chance of a few downpours in the south, but they should be localised. And into Monday, Tuesday, that is when the shower risk comes back. And we see more weather like we saw yesterday on Thursday, with these showers and storms forming over the country. And again, by next Thursday, it's all site is coming northwards. So that is one to watch. And finally, not finally yet, here's the icon. The icon is like this. So again, weekend is decent enough there. But by um, next week, now the icon has the low advancing more quickly from the west, actually. So, so by Tuesday and Wednesday, we're into a cool and showery westerly wind. So that's odd. But by Thursday, the Azores High is coming northwards. Um, but even by Friday, we're seeing more of a westerly influence there. And finally, the arpege here. The arpege is showing tomorrow to be um, a day of clouds and the low pressure gradually moving away. Some drizzle around as well especially in the morning and into the weekend we see slight pressure gradients so light winds sun spells and, and some showers and then monday and tuesday the pressure is weakening so we'll see uh showers forming and thunderstorms again it's been quite a thundery may hasn't it especially for the midlands so, so thanks for watching see you tomorrow bye for now